all right shallow makim yes back at you with another video so before i start i want to give all praises to you how about shame how shy about shame how rakak or dash double honest to all the elders and the apostles of great millstone sanitation to all the sincere akim and i want to say shout out to the house of david rise up yeah so we know about the um the bombing over there in beirut in lebanon lebanon but um we're going to check this um little um news clip out the sky news clip what he has to say and i just want to um i want to draw one script before i go into it this is act seven i find it quite amusing <laughs> uh, act seven and and 48 it says how bit how be it the most high dwelleth not in temples made with hands as saith the prophets right that's the point most high dwell if not in temples made with hands so <laughs> we're going to get to it but let's go back we'll start from the top check out this clip just after 6 p.m local time on tuesday the 4th of august <laughs> an explosion ripped through beirut's port people in lebanon's capital had earlier spotted a large fire at the port billowing dark smoke into the air. There were reports that a warehouse containing fireworks had caught fire. And several videos of the scene showed colored flashes in the flames. Videos from the scene suggest there was one smaller explosion. And then roughly 30 seconds later, this enormous shock. The blast struck with the force of a 3.5 magnitude earthquake. This was the aftermath. Windows shattered in buildings across the city and damaged cars on the roads near the port. This is where the explosion happened. Four kilometers away, in the St. Mar Mahon church, a priest and his congregation were taking part in mass. Oh, that was funny. I like that. Let's let's play that back again. That's so funny to me. I like it. <laughs> mass. <laughs> The priest and his congregation were taking part in mass, man. I'm going to read the scripture again. Acts 7, um, 14, 48 says, Here be it, the Most High dwelleth not in temples made with hands, as, as saith the Lord. The Most High ain't there. Otherwise, the man would have been all right. <laughs> Most High would have had his angels around him and would have protected him. You see, the Most High ain't there. Nowhere around there. And as for you other... Catholics and all you Protestants and all you other wicked that do what you do and you think you're not seen by the most side, we're gonna we're gonna draw some scripts for you. We're gonna lick you up with some jabs and some uppercuts, man, right now. Cause it, the most side's coming for you, man. You think the most side don't know what you've been doing? All the paedophilia that goes on all around the world in Jehovah's Witnesses and all these Catholic and all these churches that they think that the most I don't see. Let's draw this for them. Ecclesiastes 23, 19 says, Such a man only feareth the eyes of men, and knoweth not that the eyes of the Lord are ten thousand times brighter than the sun, beholding all the ways of men, considering the most sacred parts. You see, that's why the most I never had no angels protecting them. And that was a surgical strike for them. You know, not to mention what happened to that massive arm. Um, port which they say it was um which they say it was fireworks and brothers are breaking it down man it's the truth will come out let's pray that We're taking part in mass yeah they're gonna be running for their life man all of them catholic priests and all, the, all them high and mighty princes and priests and the mighty men you're gonna be running for your life man you know, run left the congregation. 
run left the congregation. You know, the hired men, that's what they do. They run left the congregation at like any trouble, man. Look at that. We're taking part in mass. Most of them might lick him too, you know, but he spared, I think he spared his life, you know. You go and get him in the, with the time when the missiles come around, man. The explosion was caught on camera 11 kilometers away in the Dabia Marina. The blast was so big that it was heard from the mountains. This video from the town of Brumana, 15 kilometers away, shows how far the shockwave reached. Boy, that was that was some shockwave, man. 15 kilometers away. This video from the town of Brumana, 15 kilometers away, shows how far the shockwave reached. 15 kilometers away. It was even heard and felt as far away as Cyprus, more than 125 miles across the Mediterranean. More than 125 Aerial miles across the Mediterranean. I've got another precept up. Proverbs 15. For all you that are doing the, the, the child trafficking around underground, think that most I don't know what you're doing. And that was just a little symbolism, a little, um, just to let him know. Just to let him know, man. I'm coming for you. Coming for you. Hypocrites. Proverbs 15 and 29 says, The Lord is far from the wicked. So it's far from the wicked. That's why I ain't going to protect you, man. When these things start. It's warming up. It's warming up. But he heareth the prayer of the righteous. And we're going to see, like I said in one of my last videos, we're going to see what's going to be for these people. These fraud people. These wicked people. Let me get another one. 1 Peter 3 and 12. For the eyes of the Lord are over the righteous, and his ears are, upon un are open unto their prayers. But the face of the Lord is against them that do evil. And there's pure evil going on in them churches, man. And all, uh, all the other places where all the other um, big businesses were out of business now. The, the hotels and a lot of people are, hundreds and hundreds of people are homeless. And I don't know if they found, it's probably going to, there's probably going to be hundreds and thousands of people. Well, injured, injured for sure. But the deaths are still, they're still finding the bodies, looking for the bodies. So this thing, even though it was a light thing still, it was a light thing for the most high. Kilometers away. But it was a devastating thing to them. This is how far the shockwave reached. It was even heard and felt as far away as Cyprus, more than 125 miles across the Mediterranean. Aerial shots show the scale of the destruction of the port it reportedly housed 85% of Lebanon's supply of grain, which was a strategic food reserve in a country crippled by economic meltdown. Yeah, it was already crippled by economic meltdown. It was already devastated. Yeah, but the most are going to put the finishing touches on it. On it, going to put the icing on the cake, man. You can see the impact on the Beirut port silos building before and after the explosion. Surrounding the silos were corrugated iron and steel structures that have mostly been destroyed. These satellite images reveal the extent of the damage. This crater was once a warehouse. Now it's underwater. The colossal force was caused by the explosion of 2,750 tons of ammonium nitrate, a highly reactive chemical which was being stored unsafely. So they say. So yeah, more things are coming, as as was being said by the prophets from the elders and the apostles on Dan. Year 2020, more things are coming. It's heating up nicely. We're gonna we're gonna end with this one. Amos 9 and 8 says, Behold, the eyes of the Lord are upon the sinful kingdom, and I will destroy it from off the face of the earth, saving that I will not utterly destroy the house of Jacob, saith the Lord. But yeah, but the eyes of the Lord are upon the sinful kingdom. So more things are coming. It's only getting warm. You know, a little taste of what's to come. So this is just a quick video, the backstory, and we know the truth. The 100% truth, 100% truth will come out, 
as as is in the dark shall be shown in the light and most are going to reveal everything so they can't hide their lies for, for too much longer so more things are coming Akim. i want to say all praises to you Shimi Yashua for giving me the spirit to do this video i want to say rise up to the house of david shall luck round be upon all the wicked and everything you've seen everything that you think you're doing that you're not being seen what's in the dark shall come out in the light and the lord eyes are against the simple kingdom i want to say shallow arm to all the yak and we out